yeah, a lot of people just push through. They're like, no, why am I so tired? You know, I've just slept. I don't push yourself. You actually have to stop. But the hard part is that our world doesn't allow us to stop. Your yeah. boss isn't going to say, oh, dude, where's your bruise? And you're not going to go and lie in bed. You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah. Chronic fatigue yeah. and anxiety or depression, it's, it's, it's a mental state, it's a mental disease. So it's difficult for someone to understand because they can't see the bruise or the cut that's happening on the inside. And I got really ill um, bronchitis. And when you're very ill, you don't, you're not hungry and stuff. And I lost a, little, a lot of weight. And I got a lot of attention from it. And suddenly, people were like, oh, wow, you've lost weight. You know, it's mm. that bizarre mindset as if, you know, it's, it's a good thing. Um, and I lost attention. You know, something, I, I never had a coach in my entire computer career. I never had, never had a coach. Wow. Um, I made all my bikinis, I made all my dresses, uh, I taught myself how to do my nails, my hair, my makeup, and the reason why is because it's such an expensive sport. When I started, I actually didn't have the money to, to do all those things through someone else. I had to teach myself, otherwise I couldn't do it. So yeah, you kind of, they always say, you realize what talent you have when you're pushed to mm. be creative. I mean, basically, it, it's silence for 10 days. You get um, your own room, which is great. Um, but it's basically, it's a bed with a mattress and a little little shelf where you can put stuff. And that's it. So it's, it's minimal stuff. You have to wear certain clothes that obviously don't expose your body. Um, you're only allowed to eat at certain times of the day. They prep the meals. The meals were amazing. I've never ate, eaten so well in my life. They were all vegan. And, but the hard part was sitting for 12 hours a day, meditating. Mm. And I mean, just, I, I don't know, I always tell a client, just go and sit outside of the garden mm. and watch a bird. They're not thinking about tomorrow, what they still have to go mm. and see or and catch, or they didn't think about what they didn't catch yesterday. They're in the presence of the moment. And sometimes they'll sit there and look at the bird bar for 10 minutes. The bird itself, it's just there, it's just in that moment. Mm. And then I'll fly off and come back. And I'm like, that is a perfect reflection of how the human brain should work. I mean... They